Hey friends and welcome to my channel. I'm your shooter and this is Norris Cove. Today you guys, we're gonna be setting up my A5. I'm gonna move this out. So in a previous video, I showed you guys my cloth and paper haul. Let me take that out. So thanks to E. Michelle, I've downloaded Digital Dash. I am officially subscribed. So what I've done is I've already gone and played these out, um, punched holes in them. Now some of them is a little wonky, like this one, and I may reprint. Uh, matter of fact, I'm just gonna take that one out for now. So I wanted to go ahead and have that stuff printed up for you guys so you didn't have to um, go through the anger of me cutting them, but this one I needed to add. So I'm gonna finish cutting this and um, hole punching it and then we'll get started. But um, I was trying to print like from my that phone, from my uh, Mac computer, and it just kept, it wasn't print right. I don't know if I didn't have the drivers for that particular printer. So I ended up printing it on 32 pound paper, which is fine with me because it's just this thick. So we're gonna go through, I think I'm gonna leave this part. Now I still wanna get some dividers from cloth and paper and I was thinking of making my own but that has kind of gone out the window um, I'm gonna leave all of this and I'm gonna try to keep this simple because this is gonna be my simple business planner for like my Etsy shop um, this home business I like the folder I'm gonna keep that of course I like this I'm gonna keep that now my only issue is let's get this in here. I want to keep the months. I need to keep December. I don't really need to keep December, but I need it. So I'm gonna keep the month because I didn't get months from cloth and paper. So I'll be keeping the months, but then comes in your weekly to-dos. Like all of this, I kind of don't need, but I'm gonna be setting up se separate sections in my um, planner. So, and I like that it has this at the top, this week's top three. I'm gonna stick this towards the front. Let's find a nice, so the introduction I want to be, I think I want it to be this. Either this or this, I think I want it to be that.
will be my daily quick little things. And when I get my tags from cloth and paper, these will replace those. Now, I wish I had my glue stick. I used it for Christmas, so this gets you into that. So that's gonna be like daily, that's gonna say daily. And it brings you here. And then, like I said, I need these month calendars, but I'm not thinking, <laughs> like, why do I need them? Okay, let's, I got it. Let's take these out. January. But I like that. It's crazy. I gotta find somewhere to put them. Hmm. <laughs> because I could keep the months like this and then go into February, take all the in-between pages out. Okay, you guys, so this is basically the thicker of the pages, and I pray we have enough room. So this is our basically running to-do list. Um, everyday schedule, this is like pretty much everyday or daily planning. And next up will be media content. I only have these here to help me kind of remember. This is where I want to put dashboards. So these little dashboards that came with it. 
that's what they're there for. Um, like I said, if it was, if I could find my, I keep tape all over here, the permanent tape. But I use some for Christmas, so I would just kind of tape those together. And then, I don't know if I did that. Now comes the media contents. I kind of want to put this in the front. There's that. And then next up, our next tab will be hourly. I, for some reason, I want to put that in the front. But I think I'll leave it. I need an extra dashboard. We're missing a dashboard person. I'm missing one. It's okay, this is sort of as it for right now. I'm sure I got one somewhere. So there we go. And this is hourly. I wasn't sure if I was gonna use this, but I did wanna have it, you know, on hand. So that's how it's looking so far. Um, I'm gonna put some of the doodads in there. Uh-oh, a little tight. There we go. So this is it, that's that first dashboard. I'm missing something. I didn't print all the dashboards because I didn't care for mostly all of them. Well, I didn't like, I'm not gonna say I didn't like. Um, some of them were okay. I just got the ones that I was more attracted to, I guess I'll say. And then I have my monthly. I probably should switch that around. But I like it the way that it is so far. Until I get my other dashboards from cloth and paper, these will do. And then I could change these to black, but I don't want to change these out with these until I see what I'm going to get from cloth and paper. And then here's that other dashboard leading us into this right here. So that's what happened. And then these are the dailies priorities, to-do list, and then here's our media um, content manager. I love this. And then here we have the hourly. Okay, let's get to decorating this side over here. So this is what well, I have three. I thought I had more. I'm going to take some of these dots out. Not all of them because what would I use? I'm gonna likely I'm gonna put those. And those just happen to fit perfect, the dots. And then I have this little card here. I'm just gonna slide that in. there, but put my little Louis Vuitton there, and she is like a must, she must go there, there, and most definitely these flags were pretty much bought for this planner, so I'm going to see if I can kind of sit them right there. I know this video is going to be long, you guys, but just hang in there with me. And then these, let me see. I just don't want them to be too far in the back. And I forget about them. These flags I will save. I do want to use this one. Um, one. Okay. 
So I got a bow. This bow I've had, I think, like on my TN, I made myself. And it's just temporary for the moment to give it a little pizzazz, but I need more jangle and all that. And this planner will pretty much stay at home. Yeah, I think I'd rather have the black tabs here, maybe some frosty tabs here. Um, I really wanna add this dashboard. Let's DIY dashboard, you guys. I mean, we don't have nothing else to do. Let's go and do this dashboard real quick because I am dying to try it. We're gonna get it as close to the edge here as we possibly can. Okay. Now I just I don't measure well. Y'all know <laughs> I am the least so they have a little entrance here. Now the corners are rounded a little bit on this side. So I kind of want to round the corners, but I don't have um I can't honestly I can't find my rounder, which I'm not worried about it. I will find it. So let's just, want this side to be it. Let's just finish squaring this up. Get it nice and even. Let's take off a little. We're just taking off the minimum just to even it up. And to get rid of that round edge. I do like the round edge, but um, it doesn't make sense to have one round edge and don't have the other. So do you want this side to be it or the matte side? Let's go for this side. I don't want the matte side. And actually, I can trim off a little bit more. I can tell by the placement of the holes. All right. Ta -da. Again, you guys, this this is just some cheap. Um, folders from Walmart. And you can just get them, cut them up to your liking. Take that out. Where was the one where we didn't have a... Kind of one in the front. Back right here. So maybe I will do my own dashboards, I don't know. Let me get a little. And see the way that sits up at top, I could just cut that out and round it. Huh. Could, because over here it's kind of overlapping. When I fold it, so. But now we know we can't take any off of that. It's still pretty big, but it's okay, I guess. I don't want to keep trimming and trimming it when it goes too small. I think you know what I'm going to do. Now, that's much better. 
better. Let's see. Yep. Perfect. Now I can put whatever goes there. Let me um, look and see. Here it is. Here's some little time clocks. And then I think what I'm going to do is just print out me some, um, I have some clear paper, and I'm just going to print out whatever that is. So I may end up doing these myself. It's not that bad as I thought. That show was just about to order. Just let it look really neat. Let me see. It's pink. Yeah, so if I didn't have that, maybe this is our And I'm thinking about putting like a budget section in here um, from e. Michelle. Okay. And then I'm going to come back and then just put hourly. I'm going to print my own. These little page things are cute. And you guys, I found these at Michael's, thanks to uh, Trika over at Trika Plans. Um, I didn't even know they had these, so you can put your months on your, you know, on the side. So I think that's it. So let's do a quick flip through. So here, I think I got a lot going on here, but it's okay. <coughs> We have our page flags, um, our little nude dots, um, sticky notes, just a little card on the inside. And then this is the first thing you see when you open it. And then personal information. And then this little flag, I mean this little, what is, what is that? Ruler. <laughs> you can use that. And I like that you can just push it back in like that. And then, I'm debating if I want to keep these in here. These like should be in a bag or something else. I think I'm gonna take those out. Yeah, they just look kind of silly right there with all this glam going on. Maybe I'll put them in the back if I got room. I don't. And then here at a glance, I have this pocket here, which would be great for receipts, um, things like that. Cash envelopes, another dashboard. And then this is what I'm most excited about, just kind of weekly planning. You can see that's weekly planning. And then this is the months, and this came with it. I'm thinking I'm gonna leave this. If not, I may order them from cloth and paper. Again, I gotta go back and place another order. And then this is daily planning here, schedule. And then our next, going into our next insert. Is the media content and that's what that looks like is that noise? and then we get into our hourly hourly and then that's what it's looking like so what I like about this is undated so if one day I'm doing hourly because I want to get into time blocking. So if one day I'm time blocking and I'm on track, I miss a day, it's no big deal. So there we go. And then we have a pocket here. I don't know if those little things will fit. Let's see. Because yeah. I just don't think I'll be using these. Do they fit? No. Oh, they do. They do. There you go. That's it. And then that's it, you guys. So I hope you enjoyed this setup. Um, it is very tedious. <laughs> I will say it's very, very tedious, but um, it's worth it. So I'm glad I finally got 
that set up and ready to go. I think I'm gonna add these to take these out the plastic. And I'm gonna add these to the other side. So that's it. That's my business planner. This is my A5. And this is a desk agenda. Let me see. Day agenda. Day designer. And this came from Target. It has some really nice colors. I started to go with the mint because mint and green, I just like my colors. But I really like this black and white. Again, this is my business planner and it will be here at the home office. So I just want to be able to open it up, go right to what I'm doing in my business today and check it off my list, do my hourly uh, time blocking, which is, where is it? Back here. Or I can go into the daily planning and then time block as well. So it probably be some changes to this, you know, in the coming months. But for now, this is what we have. All right, thank you guys for watching. And if you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.